my monster truck and it is absolutely massive. It can crush things, drive over cars, but it's never been on the road or left the property. So today I'm gonna be driving my monster truck 100 miles across the state of North Carolina to the beach where I'm gonna drive it in the ocean just like Whistle and Diesel. And if you didn't know, monster trucks float on water because their tires are massive. Here is the monster truck. As you guys probably have noticed, I have the tiny little tires on it and not the giant monster truck tires, but it's still a monster truck. Yeah, I don't know if this is gonna work. <laughs> I think this is too heavy for these tires. It does look like it, but hey, a monster truck's a monster truck, no matter how big your tires are. So we're gonna start our 100 mile journey on the little ones and we're gonna see how it goes. And if we need to upgrade to larger tires, we can always put them on, but uh, let's get started. Mile one? Mile one. Let's go. Up. Hang on. Yeah, this is not good. Who, this is a random car, y'all. Yeah. So they might not be approving the monster truck idea. Yeah, That's the one you have to look at today. Yeah. They just send you off. You got to figure that out. Yeah. I mean, yeah. So if you ever like see it, just make sure it's locked. Okay. And not just put no access. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, just put no access. Gotcha. Yeah, I appreciate you. Man. Yeah, appreciate you, man. Oh, yeah, for sure. Off to a bad start. Oh, got a rest. That's an that is definitely an undercover car. No way, driving away. Wait, is that a Georgia license man? Yeah. This ain't the North Carolina. I think he was trying something. Oh, that's all I'm saying. That's every time we try to take something out on the road, we always <laughs> get the cops called. I know. We haven't even started yet. Uh, we literally haven't even gone half a mile. I think we went 100 inches so 100 far. Inches. Yeah, I drove this 100 inches. <laughs> time to crank her up and start our journey. Woo! Every large journey starts with the first mile, so we're going to do that with the tiny tires. I will say. There's no way they can support the weight of this monster truck. The driveway that's in our house is exactly one mile. So we're going to drive the whole driveway here. And we can complete that. And we're going to be good to put the bigger tires on and hit the main road. It's actually so cool. There's so many good views. Are you kidding me? He actually made it across. How is that possible? So we probably have gone maybe like a quarter of a mile already. I don't understand. I don't get seasick. I don't get car sick. But for some reason, I feel like I am now with Carter driving. I 
think we got a flat. You can hear it leaking. You can see we hit really hard in a few spots on the tire. I literally oh. said in the beginning of the video this is gonna happen. Oh, oh my gosh. We got a flat. We only made it one mile. Wait, who's we? You got a flat. I did it. I didn't drive. <laughs> We're gonna have to upgrade from the little tires to bigger ones because we got flats and it's way too bumpy and hard to drive. So let's get to work on upgrading the monster truck to much bigger tires. These are the tires. Oh my gosh, they're so heavy. These are the new tires that we're putting on. We've actually never ran these. They're 53 inches. What's the difference between that and the last one, Carter? They're way, way, way bigger. These things are actually so big that you've never seen anything on the road this big because- It's not legal? These are actually DOT approved tires, but you just don't see anyone running because they are monster trucks. Well, it looks like your monster truck's about to take off into space at that angle. <laughs> Big truck. A lot of nuts. The monster truck has official monster truck tires and the best part about these tires is that they're skinny enough to actually fit in the lane so we can keep on going we're only at one mile we have 99 left let's go are you sure you can go all the way up yeah it's a much taller truck now oh, you are way up there dude Woo! that's freaking crazy looking car is literally sitting above my head height drive the monster truck 100 miles and now the monster truck is probably broken so we're only two miles in our 100 mile journey but something isn't right something's making like a really weird grinding binding noise i don't know if it's coming from here or from here definitely heard it on this side. but as I, I, I that's why i went so slow so it's i mean it's something internal for sure but guys we only made it two miles we might have to put it on pause and do a little bit of maintenance before we can actually road trip this thing. Well, the best thing we could do at this point is uh, just to get the truck back oh, home. Let's go 100 miles. Bailey, it's not gonna make it 100. What are you talking We're about? We're lucky we can make it one more mile back to the TMR house. Lucky? Bro, it's a monster truck. It's a monster. That's what it's supposed to do. Yeah, but it's not bulletproof. You are though. <laughs> it's just the AC. I think Ryan must have sabotaged. Ryan? <laughs> All right, well, it looks like we are making a run for it right now, getting out of here, y'all. This is just absurd. I have a feeling that we could possibly break down on the way back. It's 
only a matter of time. We're working our way back out to the road, but I'm a little bit nervous because whatever's happening, I think it's getting worse, and we might break down and get stuck. Oh, there it is. I hear that. All right, I hear that. Yeah, that is not a good noise at all. I think that's literally, it's something underneath the truck. We have to get home. One more mile. Run it, run it, run it, cut it. Could be wrong, but with his driving, I might have to get out of here. Well, at least we made it back to where we started, ground zero. Unfortunately, we only went two, three miles, which means we have 97 miles left. So this video is definitely a fail, but I'm not gonna give up, guys. If you wanna see part two, we gotta modify this truck. We gotta fix it up. We gotta make sure whatever that grind is happening isn't gonna happen and then we can drive this thing 100 miles to the ocean and then drive it with the giant tire so it floats just like Whistle and Diesel. That is my dream. I wanna do it for you guys, but it's gonna have to be in another video, part two. Woo!